Hi guys, Boltsas here. Welcome to the first episode of hopefully a buttload of the game Life is Futile. And you know what? Life actually is futile. So, um, yeah, you probably already saw my two previous videos of me doing some tutorials and all that. But uh, I figured out, you know what, this is more enjoyable for you guys. And I will also do like these mini tutorials in these episodes as well. And tell you guys, you know, uh, roughly how you do stuff. So, this is the base that we actually annexed from our enemies. They kept bugging us, they kept attacking us and steal from us. So, uh, we raged a war with them. And uh, here it is. Let's just chop every building down. So they're not uh, done yet. Fuck yeah. Uh, a character named White Adder is coming in. That is me. All right, let's go. Hang on, wait, wait, wait. Let's regroup. Let's regroup first. Regroup yeah. at down right. Yeah. Well... Hey, let's. Hey, uh, no, wait, wait. They're going for formation. No, no. They're preparing no, no. for formation. Let's just wait, wait. Let's just um, invite a new unit. Yeah, 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 yeah. I pressed yes. I'm going for the other guy. Who's that with the sword? I'm the one with the sword, he's the one with the halberd. Get wrecked, b Ah, I've run out of fucking breath. I'm fucking killing him with my fucking pickaxe. One disconnected. Mega fish! What? Oh, the server's down. Is that no, no, get out of there, lads. Get out of there, lads. I've got the heavy sword. Looking for Go for it. Hey! I think they're one guy. I'll go behind yeah, them think, then. Oh, yeah, I've been attacking you, Baxon. I thought it was just my game which crash. Yeah, we're all in those doors. Oh wow, I lost a lot. I just lost a lot. Uh, is it safe for me to just walk into your village now or whatever? Oh shit, you got hit. Oh shit. You hit him in the, in the head. We need, we need reinforcements to kill this guy. Coming. Like right now. I think he's got reinforcements coming. At least I have a, like a good sight here. I just need to fucking wake up. But he's in our camp. Oh, he's fallen back. He's fallen back, I believe. Yeah. Well, he's trying to, at least. Oh, uh, frozen. I'm frozen. We have no. in our camp. Don't freeze, you fuck. He was gonna die. He was gonna die. Yeah, we need to kill him like right now. Kill the threat and restart the game. He's standing still at my body, we need to kill him. Yeah, I'm bullied. <laughs> Jesus, someone is getting hit. It's me, I'm hitting them. They've hit me twice and I've hit them about seven times. I don't see why they don't die. Who's that helping? Who's me. the pitchforks? I'm a, uh, I'm the you want to stab with that, you have to stab, do you understand? You have to stab. Uh, yeah, I know, it's really quite difficult. Oh, one is down. Yeah. One is Get unconscious. Him. Loot him. Loot go, him go, 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 go. Kick the guy. His body. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Take everything away. Take his I'm, weapon I'm, away first. I'm destroying the saw mill right now. Yeah, do it. Loot this body. Get everything off him. One guy's the unconscious. Go for that. The I have Where the hell are you guys? Southwest uh, of the river or the lake. Just go. Yeah, there. take. Uh, be, beware me. of the That's one me. with the sword on their back. They're down. Yeah, he's enemy. Yeah, that take, is. take the sword of the guy and all that. Who is the guy? Yeah. He's only oh, unconscious. No, he's only unconscious. Oh, now he's dead. I killed, I killed that guy. No, he's pretty right, dead, mate. He's Expert, dead. I need Isno now. I'm bleeding out. I've got 30 seconds. 30... No, I'm not going to make it. I've got 20 seconds. I'm going to dive outside their palisade. I need you guys to be now. I'm on my way. I'm on my way. I'm, I'm, I'm coming. coming. So, yeah, that was pretty uh, pretty intense, wasn't it? I was mostly on the ground just chilling there, and uh, Downright was actually chopping their heads off. But, um, yeah. This is going to be a military base, and my first plan to actually make it so is flattening the ground, and I've already done that, you know, for the most part, obviously. And, uh, you know, if you're wondering how do I make sure it's flat, well, you just go to terraforming, observe, and you just check whatever is not at the level that you want it to be. I want it to be at level 6, 
you know, most of the stuff, so I obviously need to level this down a little bit and, uh, you know, some other, other parts. And, uh, I'm gonna keep this giant area here high and I'm going to put like a, uh, a keep up there and yeah, that's going to be nice. But we need to upgrade our shovel. We are using a wooden shovel and that's ju that just takes so long, so we're gonna upgrade that. Before we do that, we need ore. I already collected it just by digging somewhere. We need um, we need coal, and I'm already I'm already making it as you can see in this kiln. Here you can see that the hardwood billets are uh, you know fully heated up, and softwood billets are acting like a fuel source. So we're gonna pull out the charcoal. Actually, just in time because our forge and anvil uh, just went out, so we need to put some more in there. Oh, we didn't have enough. Yeah. So yeah, in this one, I'm actually melting some iron ore here, as you can see, for our well, buildings. And uh, a shovel is actually made by you know whatever you have. You need bars, though, I believe, or ingots. I, I'm actually gonna check that out. Let's check it out. I think you need a. Let's see how you. Let's see what a shovel needs. Forging, forge metal tools, shovel. Yeah, there you go. You, you just need common bars and one handle. And a handle is pretty easy to make. You just need some uh, softwood uh, tree billets, and we're gonna get that right now. And uh, here you can see what the, you know, how the uh, how our neighbors neglected this entire area. You just cut every tree down and then really bother uh, putting the stumps out of the ground and I was already I was busy here so I didn't really do mine either but we're gonna chop down this tree before we do so we're gonna get a sprout in order to replant a bit of it we don't want to lose these trees because if they go they go they don't come up, come back so yeah so we got a nice sprout we're gonna cut it down This is a, uh, a major pine, I believe. So softwood tree log. We will equip our saw. And we will uh, cut, cut out two billets. I'm not gonna make these actions extremely long because this actually takes a while. There we go, second one, that's enough. Okay, so we need to make a handle. Uh, it's pretty easy to make. You just right click on your uh, knife you go to craft and carpentry, I believe. Handle, there you go, and craft. All right, we've done that. Right click on the forge and anvil, go to forging, forge metal tools, go to shovel and craft. Don't touch anything. There we go, we have a shovel. It should be in our inventory right now. There you have it. We already had one, but that one is broken for a reason. We cannot equip it, so we just made a new one for ourselves. Okay, now that we have a shovel, we can finally terraform the ground, which means endless, endless hours of digging. So, uh, yeah, I'm gonna show it once. Here's a patch of ground that is not level, that is not at level 6. Right here, 6.7. And one action of digging down or lowering ground actually lowers it by 0.1 so we need to do it seven times to bring it down to level six so really important and handy to know that so right click terraforming lower ground level right click on it to make it default you just get out press e and do this a million times all right so i brought a friend this is a king rap pack swag swag yolo 420 blaze 360 no scope yep. it's a it's a canadian mr canada hello man Hello. All right. So yeah, we were terraforming here, and it just takes a shitload of time. So yeah, I brought a friend. Uh, can you? Well, we don't have a lot left, actually. Let's let's terraform here together, and after that, we're gonna build you a, a nice house. So let's see. Terraform. Observe. Yeah, I want everything to be like level six. Yes, sir. I guess. Yeah, there's not a lot left. And that big hill up there, I'm obviously not gonna terraform that. I'm gonna put like a, a I don't know, something up there. Where shall I poop out my excess dirt? Um, well, there's a lot of crap like behind the wall in front of us. 
you can just put it there. Why is it not doing it? Are you lowering or are you flattening? Lowering. I find it easier when you flatten if you go right from the edge where part of it's flat and part of it's higher. Is that, is that faster? It, I don't know. I have no idea. And then it flattens it all to like that level so you don't have to worry like, oh, am I going too low? Oh, really? So if you go to like a piece that's like a slant, it'll flatten it to the lower part of the slant. Nice. Oh, yeah. Your audio is uh, bugged, I believe. Yeah, I hear you digging twice. Alright, I'm just gonna dump all of my crap here. No poop. A and the dirt. Alright, finally done digging this goddamn place. Surf. Yeah, I think it looks cool. Nice. Alright, let's see. What was I doing? Oh yeah, I was gonna get some... I'm gonna get some softwood. Uh, uh, what are those? Planks or boards? No, the... I don't know, the first option you get to make Trade coal. in our property. Billets, billets. Be killed. <laughs> gonna kill it. Kill it, do it, man. What, is there... Oh, that tree, yeah, you can, you can get rid of it, I guess. Proper tool, what the fuck? I got the proper tool. Are you sure? Man, Are you I sure you're not trying I, to cut it down with a with a knife? I do have my knife instead of my axe. <laughs> <laughs> I was trying to knife you, that's why. It's it's fine. My lock yeah. skill is so tight. <laughs> timber. <laughs> you gotta say that every timber timber. Timber. Oh, it's some billets. Alright, so after we melt all of this stuff, we're gonna go and build your base, I guess. Oh, it's the you just need to put the frame down and then actually build it, which should take, like, no time. Yeah, I think you have. Yeah, did you collect all the resources? I have all the resources and the land's flattened. Nice. I actu I actually not build a uh, house yet. How's that uh, metal shovel treating you? Uh, shovely. Very shovely. I'm getting a lot of. Okay, you can take that. There you go. Finally overburdened. Oh, there's pills in here when you need them. Eventually. Someday. One day. 16 hardwood builds. Oh, wow. That'll be a nice uh, coal source. Alright, that's burning nicely. Let's get all the core coal we can get. Oh, damn, oh. I think that was no, it, it just it just froze for a second. I wish we could move these stones just so we can make like a graveyard to our fallen foes. <laughs> so nice to see all of this burning. Can I what are you doing? Can I cook this? He's riding me. <laughs> can, 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 I, can I cook this? Yeah, you can cook it. You should cook him. Fucking giant moose on your back. Holy shit, dude. That's that's like a ton of meat. Literally a ton. Yeah, man. What are we making? Fried beast. Fried beast? Yes. Why are you scratching the air? I don't know. I'm cooking fried beast. <laughs> Supposed to be a pot, probably. Uh, Take one for each of us. Wow, this okay. takes a long time. My cooking skill is shit. It takes oh, six meat to meet one. He yields, people. He yields. I'm gonna put you. I'm gonna put one in this bag for you. How much did you make? Two. That's it. It takes six meat to make one. Holy shit. So you just smash those six meats into, you know. Together and get one meat. Yes. Yeah. It looks like a chicken wing or something. Fried beast. Oh. What now? We build your house. No more, I yield. No pray. more, I yield. Pray, pray to the fire. To the gods. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's go. 
So it didn't really work. We tried to actually terraform this place so that we could put a house down, but you know, we were trying to build on sand and yeah, that just didn't work out. So yeah, we're going back to the old base where we can actually put some stuff down. Dun, 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 people, people of the world, this is a Dutchman building a house. Pretty much. Yeah! All that All for this. With America. Oh, Where's the, the goddamn entrance? entrance? The entrance is in the wrong spot. No. Look, look where it is, I can't get it. Wait. <laughs> Shit. Can't get rid of the furnace. It's an unmovable object. <laughs> I'll, I'll make. I'll find a way. This is depressing. All right. So we have put down the foundation of our plaster house just to recap everything. Uh, we messed up our tiny shack. Um. Yeah. I'm probably gonna contact an admin or something, and hopefully he will be able to uh, delete it. I don't know. I'm just hoping. So, um, right now, I am going to get our wall up, actually. I am going to build all of this. Well, I need to level this entire place, like this giant hill here. Uh, you know, to be able to put, like, a nice wall up here. To make sure that people cannot just jump over my wall and just get in like that. So, yeah, we're gonna work on that. This is gonna take a long time, but before we actually start on that, I'm gonna show you guys how you build a palisade wall. In order to do so, you need, first of all, you need a blacksmith's hammer. I already have that on me. Second of all, you need to level up a few things. And the first thing that you wanna level up is terraforming. This is easily done by just using a uh, shovel and just lowering and raising and, you know, playing around with uh, the ground in the terraform ter terraforming menu. Construction material preparation, you just uh, mine a place or just dig at places and which results into rock. And after that, if you have rocks in your inventory, let's say this is a rock, you just put your pickaxe back in your inventory by, uh, for instance, equipping your shovel. You just right click, go to construction material preparation, shape, and just choose whatever you want to shape into, you know, into something. So shaped rock, you need 20 rocks in for one shaped rock so yeah that's how you level up that second one the third one is just by uh, building stuff and the easiest one is actually by building those fences and finishing them that's the easiest way or you can just build uh, paved roads but that doesn't work right now you just get like a black patch like that and yeah that's that's so far what we have leveled up you can also go for masonry and you know architecture but we don't really need that right now if you leveled up everything I told you like this and yeah basically only that you just right click somewhere you go to uh, I believe construction construct you scroll down all the way until you find a palisade you built and you just click wherever you want to put it down and once you put it down this shows up and this will tell you all the ingredients you need which is five building logs and that's it after that you just click build and ta-da 
you have not, you have your own wall. That's basically how it is, but the majority of our work will go into actually leveling up this place so that we can build our wall going uphill. Um, otherwise, we'll have to like remove all of this dirt and that would just take ages, even even in a group of seven. So yeah, that's what we're gonna, what we're gonna do first. All right, so we have put down all the foundations of the palisade walls, as you can see. Uh, I just, you know, figured I'm not gonna dig this entire mountain away. That, that would literally, literally just take like a whole week in real life. So no, I'm just gonna build the walls. Of course, people would be able to just jump over them using this hill, but you know, that's that's a project for uh, for some other time. For now, I'm actually going to do something different. Um, I'm going to do some forest economy management, and I've already done a few. And if you don't know what what I mean, I basically mean replant the trees uh, that I cut down. And here you can see this beautiful tree orchard that the uh, previous owners of this place uh, actually organized. But someone cut down a few of their few of our trees. It's not a problem if someone cuts down these trees, but you know, at least replant them. I mean, that's just common courtesy if you cut someone else's trees um, and you don't want to be an enemy so uh, what I'm gonna do is uproot all of these stumps and plant new trees and if you're wondering how you plant new trees you just go to a tree first I recommend inspecting it so you see what the condition of the tree is there you go it's a major maple tree the quality is 14 out of a hundred so not really a good tree but I have inspected a few other trees and I have uh, six oak tree sprouts with quality of 60 and eight willow tree sprouts with quality of 69. So I am just going to get all of these roots out of the ground. And the way you do so is just by uprooting. And it takes a while, so I'm gonna do all of these and uh, yeah. Again with the power of YouTube editing, I'll be back in two seconds. All right, we have uprooted those damn tree stumps. Now we're gonna replant them, and it's pretty easy to do. Um, you need a pretty good skill level for this, by the way, if you wanna plant most trees. Uh, let's go to, there we go, forest tree. If you're only level 30, you can plant softwood trees, sprouts and pine. If you're level 60, you can plant some hardwood trees like birch, willow. But if you want to really just plant every every single tree, you need to be level 90 at least. And uh, this enables you to also plant elm, maple and oak. And that's definitely what you need. And level 100 is just for some extra luck points. I have no idea how that actually works. But uh, yeah. Okay, so we will right click on the ground, go to forest tree and let's plant our oak tree. Those are pretty big. And uh, they give hardwood, so. There you go. Alright, now do this a few more million times and you have a forest. Alright, we have planted new trees. I'm gonna show you that in a second. I'm just dragging this softwood tree with me. Um, this is this is what I'm gonna use to make coal. Don't you worry about it worry about anything. Yep, bolt the moose died. Damn. All right, here it is. Uh, let's go to our tree orchard. This is really important. This is like the base of everything. Having trees. Without trees, you don't have a base. So here it is. I replanted everything um, that I uprooted. That's the way it should be. Um, yeah, these trees will grow in a few real real time days, like uh, three or four days, and they would be full grown. What I'm gonna do later on is actually cut away like four or five rows of trees because I cannot see anything from my base. Like if I have that watchtower here, it actually has like no use, um, and I cannot remove it at this moment so I'm gonna I'm gonna like cut away like four or five rows and uh, use all of that wood later for something I have no idea for what yet but for now we are going to build those walls so yeah I'm going to empty my entire inventory in one of these sacks on the ground and after that we're gonna we're gonna build those damn walls and protect ourselves
we didn't have enough wood for all of these walls, but uh, I'm gonna build a few of you for you guys, so let's go. Four days later, the walls are finally finished, but not quite. We still need a gate to finish this base and actually call it a base. Um, we've put down a small plaster house, which we need to uh, need to work on. And yeah, we messed up that house, but you know, shit happens. Anyway, we have organized the base a little bit. We've put all of these, like all of the access um, supplies and all that in that corner together with all the food and all the building supplies like wooden logs and building logs and all that and this here is going to be a sparring place where people can train with their wooden weapons and all that or real weapons depends on what kind of mood that person is in but yeah this is going to be to train uh, sword fighting this place here is going to be archery range I have put down uh, two archery targets right here um, yeah the watchtower of course I will put another one down somewhere perhaps there in that corner right there and another one uh, another one here and another one close to those uh, very long and very high trees and this place will be a uh, cavalry training place I will flatten out this entire place sadly we cannot move or de deconstruct these fences we can deconstruct these half finished fences uh, thank God so we will uh, get rid of half of this and we will only keep this and perhaps we could put like our uh, I don't know um, Something like a stable here or something, horse stable, that could, you know, if it fits, we could put it here, that would be uh, kind of neat. And yeah, that's it so far. Um, I hope you guys actually enjoyed this episode, it took me like four days to get all of the footage I, you know, I have in this. And obviously it takes a lot of time to do something. So yeah, if you enjoyed, do all the good stuff, like, subscribe, comment, and also another thing, um, please check out the social network links down below because I post a lot of stuff on Facebook and Twitter. Like, what kind of games do you guys want to see? What do you want to see in this or that episode? Should I upload this or that today or tomorrow? All that good stuff. And also news on some upcoming games. So if you're a social networker, uh, make sure you check, down, check out uh, my social network links down below. And we will see each other back in episode 2, which will be about arming up. See ya.